Catching up with Jordan and Ricky Taylor and their Cadillac PV.R race car. Awaiting the halls at an auto show, it's not unusual to see a few race cars salted about. They are typically historic or vintage race cars, though occasionally last year's F1 car will turn up for a while. But it's incredibly rare that an active race car, let alone one that just took one checkered flag and will be taking another green in just a matter of weeks is dropped into the press day scrum during an auto show. But that's exactly what Wayne Taylor Racing and Cadillac did for the 2017 New York Auto Show, bringing in the No. 10 Cadillac PV.R prototype fresh off its win in the WeatherTech Sports Car Championship Grand Prix of Long Beach. We were lucky enough to score some time with the drivers of the No. 10 car, Jordan and Ricky Taylor to see how the luxury American brand return to prototype racing was going so far in its fierce year and what it's like living with Rodney Sandstorm. Jordan Taylor it is weird. It's kind of cool. Everyone's asking if it's a show car. But this is the car that's winning the races. JT, I think on paper it looked like a perfect weekend. We led every practice, we got the pole in qualifying, we won the race. But the race was actually pretty interesting. There was a new class with us, GTD, so about 35 cars on a street course makes things difficult. There were a lot of yellows, and the two car from Extreme Speed was able to jump up the strategy and take a gamble, and it worked for them. So they were actually leading the middle portion of the race up until 5 minutes to go, but we were able to get a run up in traffic and get the lead and win the race, which made it 3 for 3 for us and Cadillac for the first 3 races of the year.